Hi there, Ron here. The lesson today is called Can't Find Deals, I'm in a Hot Market. Look, in our, well, in our country today, there's no doubt that all over the United States, the market has heated up considerably in the last year or so. And, of course, everywhere we go, we get this same uh, comeback. We can't find deals because our market is so hot. Now the natural thing would, for one to think would be because the market is hot, everybody's going to list their house with a realtor or put a FISBO sign out and people are going to beat a path to the door and it's going to sell just like that. Well, the truth is there are some places where that will happen. And in fact, we have a few areas like that here in Jacksonville. But the reality is the market is never so hot, no matter where you live, that there are plenty of sellers who will offer you terms if you allow them to. Everywhere we go, we do deals. We do deals with your leads. We do single uh, day workshops called Fast Track to Wealth. Lynette Wolf attends those with me and we call your leads. She spends all morning calling your leads that have said yes to terms and turning them into deals. She's on the phone for about three hours that morning trying to reach as many people as she can and when lunch is over, we have more deals than we can discuss uh, in the hour and a half uh, after lunch. That's just a normal thing wherever we go. When we do a boot camp, we spend three days doing those deals actually, and they get a hold of a lot more of them. Her and Brian and sometimes our mentors call the leads that are all brought in. We try to reach every one of them. And by the time a boot camp is over, we've created 20 or 30 deals out of raw pieces of paper called property information sheets. Now, how can that happen? I guess it's a miracle, <laughs> or not. <laughs> we go different places, all price ranges, we're in all types of markets, high end, low end, mid end, all over the United States, and we get the same results everywhere we go. So I'm going to go over some things that you need to know about uh, getting terms deals done with FISBOs, and then let's convert it to math, and let's see the reality of it. Listen. Folks, there's nobody that knows the reality of the pretty house business more than the old guy here because we have a team of virtual assistants calling over 25,000 people a month for you. I'm going to go to the board here if you're going to follow me on this, Deb. And 25,000 people a month. That means 25,000 of your leads that you send or we find online for you are called every single month by our virtual assistant department. And therefore, we get the math. We know the math. We know how many people will say yes to terms by the VA simply reading the property information sheet and getting answers. And right now that's about 31%. And I'll grant you that's down a little because about a year ago it was 36%. So we're getting less people to say yes, but we're getting way more people to say yes than we can actually process right up to this very minute. And by the way, we're, again, our students are all over the country. That means you, wherever you live. Now let's just do some, let's just do some uh, numbers here. Let's just make some assumptions. Let's say that the average deposit on a house that you're going to put a lease option tenant buyer in or sell with owner financing is $20,000. Now I'm going to tell you right now, that's not really an average deposit. It's too low. $20,000 means you're dealing with properties in about the $150,000 to $200,000 range. I want you to get above that when you learn how to do the pretty house deals without risk, but even in that range, which should be comfortable no matter where you live, uh, you're going to get a $20,000 deposit. I would not put someone in a house on a lease option that's worth 200 or more with less than $20,000 down. Uh, some of them you're going to get a lot more, and there's going to be some where you're going to have to take less. Therefore, we get the term average. That's how we get to an average. I will tell you from experience, that's not average you're going to get a lot more than that per deal if you move on up to a little higher price deals. And let's just say, it take a yes lead. A yes lead means that the VA has called the seller and the seller has said, yes, I'll either sell for what I owe or I'll consider a lease purchase or I take my equity monthly installments. On your property information sheet, that means they've said yes to A, B, or C, which you can get right on your Gold Club site, incidentally, under uh, resources. You have to decide, okay, how many yeses does it take to get a deal? And that will depend. We'll come back to what it depends on here. 
Let's say it takes 10 or 15 or 20. I don't know. Pick a number. But for the sake of this example, let's say it takes 20. I'm going to say that you've got to actually call 20 people that have said, yes, I will do a consider terms before you get one deal. 20 yeses equals a total of about 60 leads if about 31% of them are yeses. So let me say that again. You're going to need about a total of 60 leads, total leads, to get about 20 yeses if in fact 31% of them say yes when our VAs call them. Of course that's going to vary, but that's numbers you can pretty much depend on. That means you only need 15 total leads in an entire week. In a week, our VAs will get you that many. Let's go over here, that'd be, and let's see how you're going to get these leads. So, if I only need 15 total leads a week, <laughs> you got to ask yourself, gosh, I don't know what I'm going to do with the other six days. Because think about it, we have an inbox, we have a daily inbox where we deliver FISBO leads to you every single day. Now keep in mind, you do have to go on your Gold Club homepage and where it says FISBO leads, you've got to turn it on. You've got to go over there and punch on it and say, yes, I want them, and fill in the two counties you want them in. They don't cost you anything. They're part of your Gold Club package, but you've got to turn it on to get them. So if you're not getting those leads, go turn them on as soon as you launch this video, and you'll start getting them daily. In some areas, you'll get more than others, but you'll get them. I can tell you for a fact, you should get at least 15 of those per week if you don't do anything else on this board. That's probably going to provide you with the 15 you need. But let's say it doesn't. You should have one of our VAs calling online FISBOs for you. Some of the, uh, the uh, people that are advertising online in your two counties will come to you in the inbox. Some of them won't. I can't tell you why. I just know that to be the fact. So your VA should be looking them up and calling them for you as well. Now, they're not going to call the ones that you sent in from your Gold Club site. Uh, these inbox leads come to you, you mark which ones you want them to call, send them to your VA and they'll call them for you, send you back the property information sheet. If you just do these two alone, uh, my friend, you should easily, I mean easily, have enough leads to meet our 15 minimum leads per week goal. Well, let's say you know, because we want to be conservative here, right? What's wrong with you running free ads online? Let people call you. Our VAs will do that for you. All you got to do is tell them yes, done. All right, let's say that's not enough. Can you ride around and look for FISBO signs in front of houses? I don't know why not. You're going to ride around anyway. Have your cell phone ready. Take a picture of the FISBO sign. Send it to your VA. Let them call it for you. By the way, this is one of the top quality leads right here. So be real with me. If you cared enough and you really wanted to, could you get 15 total leads a week if you didn't do anything but that? Say yes, Ron. Next, let's say all of that is still not enough leads, which is absolutely totally unlikely we have a program where we actually get people to go out and ride around for us and snap pictures of these visible signs and send them to us and we pay them ten dollars per lead through PayPal I teach that at the uh, quick start boot camp the truth is you may never need to do that because these will probably provide you more leads than you can follow up on but if you want to do it it's there when you're ready for it if you're really going to get serious and then, of course, there's a yellow letter. You know, yellowletterlady.com is where he gets your yellow letters. That's Christy King. I always teach my folks, let's don't do this because this costs money. Well, let's don't do this until we've done all of this. All of these cost very, very, very little money. In fact, most of it is cost of your VA calling them. But if you want to spend a little money to get more leads, then you can jump into these bottom two right here. Uh, you may or may not ever get to this point. I do love the yellow letters for targeting, though. In fact, we're mailing some out as we speak because I'm targeting a certain specific uh, demographic of property and this is the best way to target. By the way, if you want to do higher priced houses, this is probably the only way you're going to reach them is right here, is yellow letters. Uh, we've used yellow letters to do multi-million dollar houses. All right, so it's not about getting leads. It's not about getting leads, okay? So here's some problems that I see our students incurring in the process of of uh, trying to get out to the house and get a contract on the seller. Here's the biggest one right here. Uh, and if you're getting leads, I'll bet you you're guilty of this one. You're getting the leads, but you're not calling the yeses. Guess what happens when you don't call the yeses? Nothing. Nobody gets paid. There's no deals. If you don't follow up on the leads once you get them, then don't get them. 
because you really only have two choices here. You either call the sellers and use my scripts and get, and get to a conclusion, or you get somebody else to do it. And friend, if you're not going to do it, the smartest thing for you to do is get an acquisition that's on your team as soon as you can and let them do it for you. But somebody's got to call these leads or this part of the business is not for you. If the leads don't get called, you're not going to get paid. And when the leads are called, then make sure you use my scripts. Why use my scripts? Because they work. If you use my scripts, and you find them on your Go Club site, you find them in your boot camp manual, find them in the terms course. If you use my scripts, then you don't have to think about what you're going to say. All you've got to do is ask questions to the seller, like, what's the least you could take for the property? May I assume you'll sell with nothing down? And what's the least you could take per month? When you start asking these questions to the seller, they're making you an offer, and you're just simply asking questions, and they're telling you whether, they'll, uh, whether they're in or out. You will have to learn how to handle their objections. There's only a handful of those. Again, they're in my course and they're in, in my boot camp. But honestly, this is nothing more than just getting on the telephone, reading my scripts, and practicing a little bit until you get it. Tape record your calls, play them back, and you'll quickly fix your own mistakes. So if you're calling them, are you reusing my script? Or are you making it up as you go? If you're not careful and don't use my scripts, you're going to be a big mess on the telephone. And that's here. You made a big mess. If you're not using my scripts, you're likely going to make a big mess on the telephone. Uh, look, I can teach you what to say. I can teach you how to say it. It's not that hard to learn, but it's something you're going to learn because what comes out of your mouth will determine what goes into your bank account. And if you get them on the telephone and you make a big mess of the call, then obviously you're not going to get any positive responses. And you may not even know that that's the problem. So we've got to ask ourselves, is that the problem? Tape record the call, play it back. You'll see whether it is or it isn't. And maybe the yes is not really a yes. Well, get this. Most yeses are not really a yes. Your VA can only ask the question, a A, B, or C, whether the seller would be interested in terms. The seller will say yes or no. If the VA checks yes, that means the seller has said, yes, we will consider terms. That doesn't necessarily mean that they mean it or that they clearly understood it. And that will not, you will not know that until you make this call using my script and get to the point whether the yes is really a yes. Bad news, most of the yeses are not really yeses. So you have got to make the calls, go through the, the prospect pile and weed them down to the ones that are really wanting to do business with you. And okay, you've got to make a handful of calls to get one to say yes. In fact, over here, we just determined that you've got to make 20 calls to get one deal. So that's 20 calls to get one deal. I'll come back to that in a minute, but it's like any other business. We got to get the funnel full and weed it on down to the handful that are going to do business with us. And you can't give up too quick. This is a very common mistake. People get on the telephone, they make a handful of calls, the seller isn't saying, yes, please come out and buy my house. I beg you, beg you, beg you. So they say, well, golly, this stuff ain't going to work like it did in Ron's class. Well, here's the real deal. No matter what business you're in, in fact, let's go down here. No matter what business you're in, you're going to have the same problem. You've got to put people in the top of the funnel, weed them on down to the highest, best prospects, and then weed those on down to the people that will do business with you. We have the same problem with global publishing, you know. We have to contact thousands of people to get hundreds in the system to get a handful to say yes and actually become customers. Well, if you're watching this, you're probably one of those that actually weeded yourself down into the funnel and, and became a customer. So, you know, let's do a little bit of math. Number one, let's just say it takes 20 calls per deal because that's what we said. And let's just say each deal is worth $20,000 to you. That's $1,000 per call. That's $1,000 per call, not per deal. Would you make a phone call for $1,000 if you're guaranteed you're going to get it? Well, you're going to know your numbers pretty soon. And your numbers are what they are. And the reality is, here's the reality, most sellers are not going to work with you. And friend, you better get over that fact, because I don't care what product or service you sell, that's the case. Most people who come into your life initially express interest, just aren't going to do business with you. It's no different in our business. It's the same exact thing. We have to weed, weed through all the crap to get to the cream. All right, number two, most, most prospects in any business are worthless. Worthless. 
I have several different businesses and it's all the same. I have to go, a lot of people come into the system, come into the funnel, and most of them are a worthless waste of time. At Global Publishing, we're on radio every day. We tell the people, get my free book and CD. About 10% of them will actually spend money with us. The other 90%, we do everything we can to get them to turn into customers and not just worthless leads. Guess what? 80% of the, I mean about 90% of the 90% are never going to do business with us. Golly, we go to bed every day wondering what's wrong with those people anyway. But they're never going to do any business with us. We've just gotten used to it. So we focus our time on the people who want to do business with us, those like you. That's why I'm delivering you this lesson. And we spend all of our time trying to deliver as much content as we can to you because you raised your hand and you said yes. Well, it's no different with these sellers of these houses. If they don't raise their hand and act like they want to do business with you, get them out of your life, quit worrying about them. You did nothing wrong. It was not your fault. It's their fault. They're not ready to sell yet. They want to sell. They don't need to sell. We need to find the folks that need to sell bad enough to say yes to terms. Have realistic expectations. And that's where a lot of people fail. They come into the system and they think they're going to make a few calls and the seas are going to part and the Philistines are going to come walking across the ocean and everything's going to look out lovely and sit around and sing kumbaya. Sorry, there's no business like that, including this one. Again, we've got to talk to a handful of people to get one to say yes. You'll know your numbers very, very quick. And I'll say it again. Once you get a little bit of practice under your belt, you're not going to need 20 calls to get a deal and your average profit's going to be more than $20,000. But for now, let's use these numbers. Again, you're getting paid $1,000 per call. Seems to me like you'd want to be on the telephone all day long. That's the case. And you'll never know if you quit. So don't quit. And don't listen to what other people say. It makes no difference of what the people hanging around you are saying about the market where you live. They have no idea what you're doing. They're not qualified to render advice. You should ignore their advice totally when you know they're not doing what you're doing. And be very careful, even when you ask for advice from your competitors. Remember, they are your competitors. Do you think they really want you to succeed? Be very careful to whom you listen. Don't listen to the morons. Listen to more Ron. And I am telling you this works, and it works everywhere we go. If you don't believe it, come join us at a one-day fast track. We publish them, and we get anywhere near you, we email you. Come join us at a quick start real estate school. Bring leads. You'll see it happen right before your face. You will not be able to convince yourself that this won't work when we do it right in front of your face, hopefully on your leads, making deals for you. And by the way, we tape record all of the calls, in case you think we're pulling some kind of shenanigan or something. We tape record the calls with the seller and we email it to the person who brought in the lead. So come make us prove it. Come to Fast Track, come to Quick Start School, and you'll see the reality of the business, and I'll take away all your reasons to quit. You cannot quit. This is like, like any other business. It takes a little bit of time to learn it. Have a little patience. Uh, keep on coming to see me. Grab all the materials that we produce and pretty soon you'll be very, very good at it. And the good news is you will make more money working in these pretty houses than you will make in any other part of the business. And I promise you it will not take very long to where uh, you will see that this is worth many, many times anything else you can do with the same amount of small investment of time that you have in this business. So I hope that enlightened you a little. Hope to see you soon. Thanks for watching. Hey, I'm back. You thought you were done with me, didn't you? You aren't. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed the lesson that I just did, but then the thought occurred to me after the fact that, gosh, there's an awful lot of folks watching this that don't even have the terms course yet. So I'm going to fix that right now. I'm going to make you a very special offer. So pay close attention. There is a course that I created called Terms Cash Flow System, and it's all about the pretty house business, as we've just described here, and it literally covers everything step by step. In fact, it is beautiful. Take a look at that. Wouldn't that look good on your shelf? This thing has 14 CDs in it and 7 DVDs, literally going from beginning to end, and of course a great big old systems manual here with all the tools you need to do the business and two of the DVDs are me actually structuring deals in class that students brought in and two more of them are me making live calls to sellers so you'll hear that and then we have a couple of question and answer CDs in here as well again there's 21 CDs and DVDs in this system 
If you want to learn the terms business, this is where you start. This comes with our boot camp, but I'm going to give you a chance to get this system by itself here today at half price. This thing sells for $14.97. You can get it for $750 as long as you get it by noon on this coming Saturday because that is your deadline. Uh, and in fact, my staff don't even know this. I've got to go tell them after we get through filming this video. So if you call in our uh, 800 line, 800-567-6128 by noon on Saturday, tell them you watched the video and you want the terms course for half price. And by that time, they'll know that is $750 after they get over the shop. We've never done this before, so I hope you take advantage of it. Uh, one thing that I'm trying to figure out is how many people are actually watching this content that I make for you. And this will give me an indication on that. All right, so terms course is half price as long as you're in by noon on Friday. But Saturday. I'm uh, sorry, Saturday. Thank you, Debbie. <laughs> so, but if you want the whole uh, cash flow system, there's another module called Wholesaling and Retailing Cash Flow System. This literally is, uh, takes you through the, the whole process. In other words, this is the ugly house part of the business, and this is the pretty house part of the business. Now, this package by itself sells for uh, $500. To combine, these systems sell for $19.97, and we've sold hundreds of them at that price. But you have a choice right now. You can get the terms course by itself for $750, and I'll throw in the wholesale retail module for $300. And look, it's also beautifully packaged. And I don't know how many is in there, 14 or 15 CDs in here as well. And literally step by step through wholesaling, wholesaling and rehabbing. And if that's not good enough, look at this. Look at that box. Huh? Put, this, put these in your box. Put that up on your shelf. Tell me what you got on your shelf that looks prettier than that. Anyway, you got till noon on Saturday to call in. You can get term for $750, wholesale retail for $300. Whole thing is only $1,050, which is about half price. Take me up on the offer. See you soon. Thanks for watching.